to my channel. My name is Sherlyn. Welcome to Sherlyn and Food Etc. Today we are going to cook a uh, puto bongbong but without the bamboo steamer. Puto bongbong is another uh, kind of merienda or snack recipe or kakanin as we call it and usually very popular during Christmas time. So I'm just going to show you the easiest way without using bamboo steamer. Uh, we are just going to use banana leaves for our uh, puto bong bong. So let's go start it. So for our ingredients, we have four cups glutinous rice flour, one and three fourths cup water. So we have a uh, purple ovi flavor condensed milk. That's just for coloring to get a color to our uh, glutinous rice flour. You can use just regular purple food coloring or the ubi flavor essence just to get some purple color and that should be good. We have some margarine, some cheddar cheese for our toppings for later, banana leaves. I'm using the frozen ones from uh, I got from the uh, Asian store and condensed milk. This is just easy. Just put the water into your glutinous uh, rice flour and start mixing it until you get the dough. Okay. Okay, then we can add in our food coloring or uh, in my case, my condensed milk, which is really purple. So, puto bong bong usually is colored purple. So, that's why we are going to put some purple color in it. And it's usually cooked with a bamboo steamer. Since we don't have bamboo steamer, we're just going to use banana leaves, which is, works the same thing. I mean, banana leaves gives extra aroma into our puto bong, bong as well. Some people use foil, by the way. If they don't have banana leaves, you can use foil. This is how it looks now after put, putting our, our food color. Um, so this is all what we need for our puto bong bong. It's just the glutinous rice flour, some water, and the food color, which is the purple. Uh, so the food coloring, you can just add it uh, extra if you want it more darker than this. But uh, it's up, up to you guys. Okay, so next we are going to shred this into bits we're using a cheese grater and we're using the smaller grater side and that's uh, how we're gonna do it okay we're just gonna take small pieces at a time and then we'll slowly uh, shred this like this if you can see it turns into small little bits of pieces it's like imitating tiny pieces of rice Okay. So this is how it looks now after uh, shredding it. So next we're going to put it into our banana leaf before steaming it. Um, so we are going to spoon it in our banana leaf. So there's this banana leaf. We have to brush a little bit of butter in the middle. So it's not going to be, it will be easy to take it out. Okay. So just like that. And then we'll spoon in our little boom boom mix. I think we call this galapo in Filipino. I'm not sure. <laughs> but 
yeah so don't put too much guys because um this this thing is really filling if you eat just two it's it really fills you up because it's uh, sticky rice right so just like that then we can just roll this up and don't uh, really squish it just roll it gently so it looks like this you don't have to fold the sides just have to leave it like this or if you don't want the thing to unroll just tie a little bit in the middle then we can put this in our steamer just like that So my frozen banana leaf is not really a good quality. Some of it is ripped, so I have to use whatever is uh, left. Okay, just like that. And then roll it up. Okay. So make sure this side that's open is down so it's not gonna unroll. We'll hold it. Okay guys, this is how it looks like right now. So we're going to steam this for at least 10 to 15 minutes in medium heat. Okay, here you go guys, after 15 minutes. This is fully cooked. We'll put it in our plate and taste it. Okay. First, we are going to brush some butter or margarine. Top. Grated coconut, freshly grated coconut, and then our grated cheese. This would be our condensed milk. Here we go guys, I'm the tester. It is my first time to taste this dessert, but it is very good. Thank you, say, Han. Say poto bong bong. Poto bong bong. <laughs> poto bong bong. Poto bong bong. There you go. That's another snack. Salamat po. You're welcome.